Chapman tried to take it away from McCann again, but uh, that wasn't quite in the script, and it might open up this time for Queen's Park Rangers. Bustling forward this time, still going, and it's an excellent save from Daniel Everson, who manages to knock it away to safety as well. Hughes has got it here for uh, North End, and it was a wayward ball presented on the plate here for Chair, who's uh, going the long way around Bauer and tries to find the corner too. And, uh, well, it was touched by Daniel Everson wide. It's Queen's Park Rangers who've had the best chances in the game so far, but now it could open up for Alan Brown, who goes forward this time. Can he chip it over the keeper? Three players on the goal line, and one of them are able to smuggle it behind. Hughes will arrive now on the overlap. Cunningham is a little further ahead as well, as uh, he leaves it to his fellow countryman Brown, and uh, Whiteman again is involved with a clever ball. Brown on the left-hand side, looking in field with his right foot, touches it to Whiteman, and now Hughes, who can hit it first time as his cross comes forward, and it is helped in, and it's another goal for Emil Rees, and there's the moment of magic that we were asking for. McCann, he's charging away down the right-hand side now. No orange boots for him in this second half, incidentally. He's changed them to white, and uh, Whiteman finds Johnson, also in white boots, as uh, he tries to throw it forward for Cameron Archer, who's onside here. Archer running at the defender now, looking to try and find a way through. Still going, it's Archer! What a fairy tale story it is turning out to be for Cameron Archer. There's just no stopping him. Johansson with the corner, sent in dangerously towards Sanderson. Could drop again here for Dykes and helped it again. Blocked on the line, it's a real goal mouth scramble. And uh, it's Everson who was able save. to make another fantastic save. Miraculous. Now it's Daniel Johnson striding forward over the halfway line. Held up towards Maguire. And now Archer spilled by the goalkeeper. Maguire looking to finish it off. Oh, they've been giving it away here. Daniel Johnson now, he hasn't got a huge amount of support with him. He's just waiting for it this time as he tries to find Sean Maguire. And uh, now it's Archer! Saved by the goalkeeper, Mahoney again. He's busy, but a busy man in this second half. Free kick, which uh, they've taken quickly. It's Thomas this time, looking for Andre Gray, who's in this time from a tight angle. But who's there to save North End? But Daniel Everson again. Dangerously played in towards the goalkeeper, who did well to punch it in the air, and it's dropped for Archer, and there was just too many bodies on the line there. This is Dizel showing he's still got plenty of energy as he runs forward late in the game, but he's overrun it. It's Maguire this time, laying it through towards Alan Brown this time, through on goal for Brown, and it's another save by the goalkeeper. The corner is played in towards the penalty area, and, uh, well, they're going to get a penalty for a foul by Daniel Johnson. Andre Gray is ready with the spot kick here for Queen's Park Rangers. It could and perhaps should be too little too late, but Gray from the spot does score, and Queen's Park Rangers do have perhaps a very late lay fly with seconds to go.